house is just different living there, man. The police can't even control nothing. Like, it's how bad it is in Detroit. I seen a police officer get out of a police car and put the club on it. I knew it was time to move when I seen that. I was like, they taking your stuff. It's a wrap. It's different, man. It's just a weird place to be from. Like, if you ever end up in Detroit, like during Halloween, never go to a haunted house in Detroit. Never go, because there's nothing scary about a haunted house in Detroit. Only thing scary about it is standing outside of the haunted house. That's the scariest part. <laughs> Everywhere outside of the haunted house is scary. Like, I'm talking about we driving, we pull into the parking lot, there's a dude with a ski mask like, yeah, I'm here to valet park your car. <laughs> I look at my girl like, he think I'm stupid, don't he? I'm like, get away before I stab you, sir. <laughs> Me and my girl, we sitting in line, we waiting to go into the haunted house, and then we ready to, you know, for the whole experience. You hear like a chainsaw in the background, and you hear like a witch cackle, and then out of nowhere, a zombie just jumped out like, boo! Hey, I got some kush on me, cuz. I'm like, what is you talking about, man? Are you trying to sell us weed, bro? What are you doing? was mad as hell, like, go get your manager, dog. The manager come back, like, sir, is there a problem? I'm like, yeah, your zombie just tried to sell us some kush, sir, that's the goddamn problem. He like, oh, I'm sorry, did you just want some regular weed? I don't understand, sir, like. <laughs> you know this is a crack house, right? Like, where did you think he was at? I was like, baby, we've been standing in the line of a crack house the whole time. My GPS must be broke. <laughs> like what you just saw? Subscribe below to our YouTube channel and you can see even more. I'm not suggesting. Like, do it now. I can see you. I will wait.